jobs as far as job security we didn't think that through <laughs> but we have a job because you folks come see us Knott's Prairie Farm they care a whole lot about live music let's hear it for Knott's Prairie Farm <laughs> our friends sit over this side so we're our friends We are we're so uh, glad to be doing this inside of this particular venue. This is a very famous venue, the Birdcage Theater. But this New Year's Eve, we're going to be at the wagon camp. It's going to be a big party, so join us New Year's Eve. This is a show that we call the Hillbilly Holiday Spectacular. <laughs> On the bass, we have Kevin Stewart. Thank you, Kevin Stewart. Thank you. 
right now uh, we'd like to do a sing along. I think these kids get stressed out. Poor kids. This is a tough time for kids. Because they're trying to be good. This is the, this, well, they actually they just end up having a good night. I think we should do this song for the children in a way that lightens it up just a little bit. And I might walk around with a microphone and have people sing it. So don't be shy. Just join right in. Alright, children. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better watch out. I'm telling you what, everybody. Santa Claus is coming to town. I hate to say this. Just read the old list. Check it twice. He's going to find out who naughty you not. Santa Claus is coming to town. Snoopy is very important here. And this song relates to Snoopy. It's a Christmas version that starts out with a version of O Time Mom, which is O Christmas Tree in German. The original language was German, so I think we should sing it in the original language. Well, that's a very good idea. You and me. All right. Oh, 
made it worse. <laughs> So impressed with what Dennis has done with the Orange Blossom special. The Orange Blossom, actually, this time of year, we shouldn't even call it the Orange Blossom special. We should call it the Poinsettia Blossom special. <laughs> okay, that wasn't funny. But what I'm trying to get at is he has turned this song into an amazing Christmas extravaganza. Just this song alone is amazing. He has taken and compiled a ton of Christmas songs, a ton of them. He came to count them. And he's put them and placed them in a very short segment of music. I tried to count them, couldn't even tell you how many there are. There's probably maybe 60 songs. How many are there actual? Nine. <laughs> Still like a whole lot of them. Still is impressive. It was impressive to me is how each song becomes the next song without any warning or a transition. You might not want to clap through this because you'll miss what he's doing. By the time you recognize the song, I'm sorry, I'm pointing my head. <laughs> what is this thing called? Mallet. Hey, I, I, I'm a Uno mallet. I use, some people use two mallets, but not me. I'm a Uno mallet. The duo mallet is another technique in that. I completely, anyway, sorry, I forgot what I was talking about. <laughs> We're going back to uh, the Orange Blossom's version, the Christmas version. What's incredible to me is that each song becomes the next song without warning. And also what's incredible about this is it's always in the same order. How do you do that? How do you remember the sequence? I wrote them down on a piece of paper and memorized them. <laughs> If you all can hear what I hear, you know that this building is going to be having a blue Christmas on the first Noel with three kings. The least will be rocking around the Christmas tree with Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Who will be wearing silver bells while we sing Joy of the World with the help of a little drummer boy. For 12 days. <laughs>
future of it is choir. Jazz on the Elvis. We need everyone to sing, even if you don't have teeth. We need everyone to sing. If you're toothless, go ahead and try to sing, try to pronounce the words. It's hard. Because it's there. But I need all the women, all the altos, all sopranos to sing this. Ring, 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 Lay 